Yo, Vic here. We're testing out a couple new gadgets here. Don't even know if I need the, the headphones on or not. Stole the headphones from the kids. There's some Rockvilles. Look at that. Pretty dirty. And I bought myself a MV51. Giving that a little rip. Can hear myself through the headphones here. Got it plugged in. Let me uh, just show you what we're working with. It's a pretty cool little gadget. You pretty much hear everything. I'm going to take these headphones off in a minute. Just give that a little, little try. I'm in the uh, podcast setting. Vocal. And I'm about, I don't know, 12, 15 inches away from my mouth here. Giving her a little whirl. Um, let me let me pop these headphones off. I can hear myself talking. I can kind of adjust everything with this thing. So like right now, I just I just volume the back, and I can bring it back up there. And I guess you can play with the settings a little. I'm gonna try it a couple different ways, and see if this helps me out. And you guys can hear me a little more clear. Get a little more professional here. And I'm almost to the podcast. Uh, the, the stuff I need for the podcast. I guess you got to have hosting and you, you got to go through maybe like an iTunes. I'm, I'm not computer. I'm not technical like this. I'm I'm not good at any of that. It's just not, not my gig. It's never been. That's more my sister's gig. She, she I got to call her up and a few other people help me read instructions and figure it out. But we'll get it done. We'll figure it out. Hopefully you guys can hear me a little better here. But... Hopefully we all can grow. Uh, talking about growing, uh, Joe Neon, I really appreciate it, man. You helped me out, push over that 400. I was looking for 500 subscribers for the new year, but hey, set your goals high, right? You got to push hard. Uh, no big deal, but maybe we can do 1,000. I was thinking that, 1,000 subscribers for 2018, that'd be insane. But we got to have the right content. So, obviously, you guys see my contents a little bit all over the board here, but we're trying to figure it out, just like anybody. Um, I don't know if the hunting, the fishing, a little bit of boating, uh, the Adirondack stuff's been pretty good. I guess my subscribers are really liking that. That was cool. We went really hard this year. If you guys couldn't tell, if you look back in those videos and to the new subscribers, and thank you for uh you know referral joe and having your guys uh come over and check my page out. i thought that was really huge that was cool so i'm gonna be stepping up my game here definitely leave comments let me know where we're at let me know what we can do and i don't think i need these headphones out i'm just hearing myself but let me pop these off and hold on get right back to you with that hold on <laughs> okay i'm back not sure if that helps at all but uh definitely a world difference it's a little annoying with the uh, headphones on. Maybe the next time I'll work on some more lighting here. I know it's a little uh, little dark. Got to get some more light on my face. But, hey, we're growing, guys. I really appreciate it, guys. The new people following me from Joe Neon. Um, I got a lot of things coming up this year, 2018. We're, we're going to be doing some more rabbit hunting. So if you guys like the small gaming, you know, uh, ruffle feather grouse. We get part maybe some partridge in that area where we go definitely some rabbits and we might be on to some snowshoe hare uh, my buddy mike um he's got the dogs and the dogs will run them he, he has got them in the past and we know what they look like their runs and stuff so bear with us so that should be going down and definitely some coyote hunting um i got a few friends of mine are pretty excited to get out there but with this weather it's been a little nippy no one no one gets really excited to go hunting when it's uh you know negative numbers and i guess we have a high and a snowstorm coming a high of zero i think in the next couple of days and i think a negative 14 at night so it's it's definitely not anything to go rush you know rushing after here and getting in the woods or wherever you're doing but hey i was out there all day today running the roll-off truck was kind of cool took a few hours to get a run and plugged in you know putting a little kerosene in there uh, a little fuel additive checking all the fluids had a a flat tire had to get all the tools out get that all rigged up but after a few hours you get it going get a few jobs done it was a nightmare going to dump everything at the dump was frozen solid every every roll off truck coming into the dump was frozen and you know you got to get scraped out and they don't get cleaned up perfectly i i 
I can't control that. That's just how it goes. I think that's how all the roll-off guys been doing it. But um, back to them subscribers and the new people watching. Yeah, leave those comments. It helps me out a lot. And hopefully uh, my little speaker here helped me, the microphone will help me, you know, be a little more clear. And obviously I'm working on my vocals here too. So I'm growing, I'm learning. It's a new little challenge for me. And I do I do really like doing it. And it's it takes me away from the real world a little bit, you know, the regular hustle and bustle of the day. So, I'm, you know, it makes you happy. I mean, what do you, what else do you want to be in life? You got to be happy, you know. So, if I could share some of the experiences that I, you know, over the 30 years here that I experienced, I, I'd like to share with you guys, especially the younger crowd. Um, I do want to talk about what happened tonight. I had to get oil, uh, just to... Uh, just a change of oil in the car at a little Honda. So I'm over at Walmart. I always go pick pick around at the ammo, see if there's anything for sale. There was some. You're not gonna believe how much I paid for this. I got this one. I got four boxes of these. Right? And four boxes of these bad boys. Let's see which one we got here. Yep. Some 20 gauge. Guess how much? Insane. I couldn't walk out of there without buying it. I'm not an impulse buyer, you know. I didn't buy what I need. This was like, you walk by and it's like, whoa, did I just read that correctly? $2.50 a box. Got to do it. Got to buy it. If it's just for target loads or if we're going to go out playing around, whatever. Got to buy the stuff. That's that's the cheapest I've ever seen uh, shotgun shells for. Two dollars and fifty cents. It was insane. I, I thought it was a pretty cool steal. And we literally, I sent my buddy Chris over there, and he, I think he picked up the last of the few boxes of the twelve gauge shells. And I guess guys like using three inch rounds, but who cares? I mean, for two dollars and fifty cents, you send it downrange. Don't complain. Don't ever complain <laughs> when you find a good deal on something. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna give this whole podcast thing a, a shout and or a try. And a, you know a good run and i'm gonna figure it out and see what's going down and see how that all works and maybe i could do the podcast uh and video at the same time and have some maybe some guests on and and interview these guys and and try to make something of it you know i'm, I'm sh i know a lot of really high-end people i know some really smart people i know you know the whole fleet you know whatever you want to know we we got the person for you i'm sure Pretty talented guys we're surrounded by. So maybe if I can do this podcast, I, I people have been asking me actually, friends, family, what you know, what's this podcast gonna be? I don't know. I don't know. Who cares? We're gonna come up with something and we're gonna kick its butt. It's just how we roll, man. What do you want me to do? Let's figure it out. Let's make it rock and roll. I don't have to do it down in my little room here. We'll. We'll go in another place. We'll dress it up. We'll get a nice table made. We'll do some, uh, maybe like an antique table, do some iron work, concrete, whatever. We'll we'll make some chairs. We'll get the people, the right people. We'll have a glass of wine. We'll have some drinks, a beer. We'll sit down, smoke cigars and pipes. I don't care. What do you want to do? We'll do it. We'll figure it out. All right? Thanks for the new subscribers. 400 subscribers for 2017. Let's hit 1,000 for 2018. That'd be awesome. And I think I'm pretty much rolling into 300,000 total page views. That's nuts. I never even thought I could do that. I do know some people that have thousands upon thousands, but, you know, they, they, they're phenomenal. They're, they're, they're really talented people, and, they, and I, I get it. My page is all over the place, but we'll figure it out. You guys are staying with me, so um, I really appreciate that. Hang in there, and uh, hopefully this little mic here is picking up my voice pretty good. This is a little trial run. All right, guys. Thank you. Talk to you soon. I'm going to be making a nice little snow plowing video probably again. Uh, tomorrow we're getting four to eight inches, so we'll, we'll give that a run and see what happens. But uh, stay tuned. Thank you.